Sea shanties? Soon may the weatherman come To bring us sugar and tea and rum One day when the time is done We'll take our leave and go What's up, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of Rhythm Clapping. My name is Mr. Gordon, or you can call me Mr. G, and I'm a junior high school band director. It's my job to make sure that the students are learning about music and having fun. And today we're going to clap along with a sea shanty. Now I know right about now half of you are very excited and half of you are pretty confused. So let me just take a minute and explain what's going on with sea shanties. What will we do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? A sea shanty is a traditional folk song that was sung by sailors in the mid-19th century. But in the past few months, sea shanties have become very popular again, especially on TikTok. Sea shanties! People are having so much fun singing them that 2021 has already been dubbed by some people as the year of the sea shanty. The 2021 is the year of the sea shanty. A sea shanty is a call and response song that helps sailors work more efficiently and in a more enjoyable way. These songs were originally adopted from the call and response songs that slaves would sing while they were working, and usually the call is sung by one person and the rest of the group would sing the response while working together to complete a task. The recent revival of the sea shanty probably has a lot to do with the fact that people are looking for ways to sing together and interact during quarantine, and TikTok's duet feature works well to help people collaborate and sing these fun songs together. All right guys, so the most popular sea shanty on TikTok right now is the Wellerman. And believe it or not, the Wellerman doesn't even qualify as a sea shanty. That's right, because a sea shanty is supposed to have a back and forth, otherwise known as a call and response, to help the sailors work. But since everybody likes that song so much, I figured out a compromise. We're gonna sing a SpongeBob SquarePants sea shanty using the melody and the harmony that you get from the Wellerman, but using the call and response that you hear in SpongeBob. Now let me give you the beats and the rhythms that you're gonna need to be able to sing this with us. All right, so I'm gonna clap and count these rhythms for you, and then you clap them back to me. Call and response. Let me give you the beat. Okay, I'm going first. We're gonna start off easy with the quarter notes. It goes like this. SpongeBob SquarePants. Now it's your turn, ready and go. All right, now listen to me. Here's some eighth notes now. Squidward tentacles. All right, now it's your turn, ready and go. Okay, now we're going to combine the quarter notes and the eighth notes like this. Patrick Star, Patrick Star. Okay, your turn, ready and go. And the last one has all eighth notes like this. Gary Sandy Popcorn Bubbles. Now your turn, ready and go. Alright, great job. And now you're ready to sing the SpongeBob SquarePants Sea Shanty. But before we do, I have some words of encouragement from a friend of mine. Now you might not recognize his face, but I'm sure you're going to recognize his voice. This video is for Mr. Gordon and his music students. Yay! I'm asked to remind you to keep practicing your instruments. Although remember, mayonnaise is not an instrument. Horseradish is not an instrument either. However, beans are very musical. <laughs> you can do a solo with that stuff. <laughs> Just warn me first, okay? Also, clap and count those rhythms. Here we go. One, eight, seven, nine, fourteen, twelve. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Absorbent and yellow and porous is he. Jellyfish come to change our rhythm and make it fun. One day when the bubbles are gone, we clap our rhythm and sing. Who lives in an Easter Island head? And even though his name is Squidward, he's actually an octopus. Soon may the jellyfish come to change our rhythm and make it fun. One day when the bubbles are gone, we clap our rhythm and sing. This friend is not too bright, you see. But at least he's smarter than Mr. Hey. Soon may the jellyfish come to change our rhythm and make it fun. One day when the bubbles are gone, we clap our rhythm and sing. Here's four of SpongeBob's favorite things. Brass, percussion, woodwind, strings. Jellyfish come to change our rhythm and make it fun. One day when the bubbles are gone, we clap our rhythm and sing. Soon may the 
the jellyfish come to change our rhythm and make it fun. One day when the bubbles are gone, we'll clap our rhythm and sing. All right, great job, everybody. You deserve a round of applause for that. And of course, our easy button. That was easy. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna do it for us today. Thank you so much for watching. And if you like this video, please hit that like button. Please subscribe. And of course, watch my other rhythm clapping videos. As always, stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy, and I'll see you again next time.